report says it has launched an investigation into whether some of its vehicles have the correct fuel mileage listed. The automaker says a flawed mathematical model may have caused it to overstate gas mileage and understate pollution. Ford has now hired an outside firm to test the 2019 Ford Ranger. If problems are found, then Ford will start looking at models going back to 2017. Tonight we are hearing the call for help made moments after a six pound rock was thrown off an I-75 overpass crashing through the windshield of a van that Kenneth White was riding in. White later died and five teenagers were charged in his death. Last year, four of the teens pleaded guilty to manslaughter. Today, two of those teens were inside a Genesee County courtroom where that frantic 911 call from the night that White died was played for the judge to hear. Genesee County 911. I'm on 75, I need to myself, so I'll come to the windshield. My windshield. The judge will determine whether the teenagers are going to be sentenced as juveniles or adults. A ruling was not made on that today, so another hearing is now planned for next month. A Detroit man is in custody in Ohio after allegedly posting to social media he was planning a mass shooting. 28-year-old Cameron White is accused of making the post that claimed he was planning to return to Detroit to carry out the shooting. He was arrested in Youngstown, Ohio, and is now awaiting extradition back to Michigan to face charges of terroristic threats and computer crimes.